Have you ever noticed this cool vehicle from Star Wars? Today we're gonna talk about it, but first I'll show you some more information about this unique design landscape. I can't understand how we got by those troops. I thought we were dead. The Force can have a strong influence on the weak minded. Do you really think we're gonna find a pilot here that'll take us to Alderaan? Uh, most of the best freighter pilots that will be found here only watch a step. This place can be a little rough. I'm ready for anything. The Ubrican 9000 Z001 Landspeeder appears in the very first Star Wars movie A New Hope parked outside the Mos Eisley Cantina. The original design was inspired by the space pods of Stanley Kubrick's film 2001 A Space Odyssey. In 2018 LEGO released its first set of the Star Wars Cantina including the land speeder and this was the very first time that this vehicle was officially produced as a toy. In the building instruction Greedo was shown as the pilot. In collaboration with Collection Wars I created a 6 scale replica of the Urican land speeder that was limited to 10 pieces. Every model comes with a signed plaque and certificate. My creation of the land speeder comes with a lot of details. The vehicle has four dome shaped windows and when you zoom in you can see the Tatooine desert dust on the acrylic glass. On each side I painted the red logo which is very screen accurate. All over you can see some battle damage and weathering. My latest version has the white wires on the outside as to my first ones were black. On the top there is a little antenna and by removing the lid you can see the interior design of the cockpit. The cockpit has a joystick for the pilot two blinking LED lights and various stickers on the control panels. As an homage to the European land speeder, I made a special decal for the screen showing the ship parked outside the Mos Eisley Cantina. You can place a 6 scale Greedo figure on the grey design ladder seat. I hope you enjoyed my review video on this Uprican Landspeeder. If you want to see more cool stuff from Legacy Arts, don't forget to hit the subscribe button.